trial and error drawing. Great ideas don't just happen in an instant. Usually they have to be modified and improved again and again. This video shows you how you might improve this process. So this exercise is called trial and error drawing. And what it's trying to show you is that um, whenever we try to learn something, we make an effort, we do something, and then we evaluate the results of what we've done, and then we try to improve them. And this is an ongoing process. And scientists, mathematicians, engineers, artists, we all do this all the time. So this exercise will illustrate that. I'm going to time myself for two minutes and I'm going to just look at the drawing of the car. So, two minutes to look at the car, trying to take in as much detail and remember it. I'm trying to commit it to memory. So now, I have to turn the photograph over, face down, and begin drawing the car from memory. Now some details are easier than others. I know there's two wheels, for example. I know a car has two wheels. I know it had the top section. I'm stuck. I can't remember this bit. That's all I can remember. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to look at the photo again. But this time we're only going to have another minute. So I've taken my timer down to a minute and I'm going to look at the photograph and see where I went right or wrong. Well, grave digger, that's really wrong. wrong. That should have been well over here. I've seen the beginnings of this circle, but not all of it. The windows are not bad. That's not bad. This is quite good. So this front section, there should be a wheel there. Okay, so, I've now turned the photograph back over and I try to draw again from memory. Okay, so now we can turn the photograph over and judge our work. Um, and we can see what have I missed. Well, I missed this here. I missed that bit. I missed that there. Um, that wasn't too bad. That was okay. But this line should have come underneath those exhaust pipes. That wasn't this line, it was actually that line, like that. So, when we draw like this, when we're drawing from our memory of something we've been studying, it helps us if we keep practicing this process. It helps us 
to improve our short-term memory, it helps us to um, retain things longer, and it, it improves our work in mem memories too. So try this, practice it. It's no good just doing it once. It's like any form of exercise. You need to keep repeating it over and over and over again to get better at it. And if you do that, I do believe your working memory will improve.